Let me make this very clear. I've already seen this. Obviously, it's been out for like four days now. And I wanted to stream it, but then Hasib kept telling me, oh, we have to delay it. We have to delay it. We have to delay it. But anyways, if you guys haven't seen this, this is SDS Mastermind, the final quarterfinal game between Rory, Rory Jennings, Chelsea super fan, versus star player, SDS's very own. And yeah, if you guys didn't know, the winner of this is poised to play against me in the semifinal. So there's direct, what is it, causation in terms of like, I'm directly impacted by what I'm about to watch here. Star player, Arori. Let's see what who, let's see what goes down, let's see who wins. Welcome to SDS Football Mastermind Season 2. The rules are simple. There are four rounds and a maximum Hopefully of not 40 points right? to reach. Each round is a different format of a football quiz that will test both the contestants' football know knowledge okay, and perfect. how well they can deal with pressure. This is an eight-man tournament, and by the end of the series, only one man will be crowned the SDS Football Mastermind. Shout out to M12 Alfuzan, who was a big inspiration behind this series, and feel free to check out his channel in the description below. Wow! Welcome back to SDS Mastermind Season 2, and what a matchup I have in front of me. It's still the quarterfinals. We have star player versus Rory Jennings. Two men who admire each other. There's no rivalry here. I think both of them would be happy to lose to each other, which is a different dynamic. That's to the rest so of the right, episode. by the way, huh? Rory and stars have the weirdest relationship I've ever seen in my life. Like, Rory loves star player. Like it's so yeah, he he just loves stars. Like fair enough, bro. I don't know, I don't know why, but he just has this in, like he absolutely like that's his favorite SDS member, star player. Just loves him, man. Every time he's on an episode of him, he's always talking about star player, star player, star. I, I don't know why, bro. But this is such a funny matchup, bro, because there's no beef here, there's no rivalry. It's like they're boys, bro. They're boys, and it's the funniest. Like you know, like if you were to create a friendship, right? Like oh, these two people are like. They're peas in a pod, if you want to call it that, right? Or they're very similar. Rory and Stars are so different, bro. But maybe that's what makes them work so well, man. Honestly, they're funny, man. So I kind of like it. But at the same time, the pressure is there, Stars. You were here for season one. You're one of the few people in this series that are back for another season. You earned your spot in front of really a few did. hundred people live on stage. But no one's dealt with that kind of pressure. And this is a pressure-based show. Yeah. So you've dealt with a different kind of pressure to everyone yeah. else. And stars, by the way, for me, I believe he's the dark horse of this entire season. Obviously, I beat Stars last year. But it was probably my closest game that I ended up playing. Probably was even closer than uh, my game against Faisal. And then in the live show, he absolutely destroyed Fuad. Like killed him in front of people, which no one has done before. I'm already terrified off the back of everything you said there. Yeah. That's some entry. He won in front of 300 people. I don't know why I feel more nervous here yeah, than I do I on the live it. show. I'm you seem so comfortable with the live show. Short straw, you know when you do the draw for it? I've become very unlucky. No, there's a few shortest draws you could have drawn. Do you think? Yeah, it was a tough, Defi it was tough. Definitely, bro. What, stars are the shortest start? Come on, man. Come on. Hey, you're looking at the champ right now. I don't want to say it, but come on. What about a guy who beats stars? Season. Stars isn't the only like tough competitor. There's a few tough competitors. No. Oh no, but this is like if I, if you draw Man City in the FA Cup, and that's what I'm oh, doing. I've drawn Man City. Nah, I don't do that. This is <laughs> Stars is if you draw like Liverpool, right? Like you don't want to draw City, you don't want to draw Ars. No, he's not even Liverpool. I would say nah. He's like if you draw Chelsea. You don't know what version of him you're gonna get. He's potentially dangerous. There's a lot of talent there. Sometimes it gets bottled up, but he, he's a, he's a dark horse. That's what he is. He's a dark horse, man. City in the FA Cup. I'm drawing Pep Guardiola. Wow, wow. He's disrespecting well, me low key. See how bro. it goes. I mean, you are a kind of sort of an unknown entity. You've been watching football for a long time and you probably know a lot of things that he might not know. But True. this game True. Show Rory's is Rory's knowledge about of like the older speed. stuff is crazy. It's about pressure. It's about trivia stuff. A lot of questions aren't even that hard. It's just about can he remember this little fact or that True. team that played that True. team. So we'll see how it goes. I'm excited. I know you guys are excited. So what we want you guys to do is leave your comments below right now on your predictions on who's going to progress to the semi-final. You know what? I'd love to get my revenge on Leah. Yeah, see, I don't think you want to do that, man. When somebody's out to retain, Thanks. they've always got a little bit extra about them. Yeah. You're looking to retain the crown. Don't want to play yeah. You need him to get knocked out. You see, now he's talking. Now he's gassing me up. Keep, keep going, bro. Facts. Facts about Manchester City. Bro, Stars, you don't want this work, bro. You don't want this. I hope you beat Rory. I hope you get your revenge, bro. Just beat Rory first. Right. This is what he's looking to retain. I don't want it anywhere near me. I don't want it anywhere near Why me. Why is it blinded? Okay, I'll put it down, it's gone. Because I, I only have a small chance as it is. But if I were to have any kind of interaction with the trophy, you know what I mean. The only thing I'm happy about, the trophy was lifted on Rory's side rather than mine. But in your eye line. So obviously, yeah, you don't want to look at the trophy, but 
up for grabs if you do win the whole series you get the trophy your name gets engraved on it you get to take it home until season three starts so that's like a good time you get to keep it be on my mantelpiece <laughs> my kid will be so proud of it and you got to have your name on it you'll also get a free ticket to season three and also a two thousand pound cash prize for the winner as well which mm. is kind of handy I didn't know mm. that. I didn't know He's that as well too. I'd have been studying. But without further ado, those are all the intros. We've done everything. It is time to start Mastermind between Star Player and Rory. All right, so the first question. Who's going to have the opening bid? We'll start with you. He's guessing now, might as well. Okay. How many teams in 30 seconds can you name that currently compete outside of the top five leagues? Top five will be England, Spain, Italy, Germany, and France. Oh! I can name 10. 11. I can do 12. 13. <laughs> <laughs> I think I can do more, but now I'm getting slightly scared. I can do 15. I'll go 16. Yeah. Do it. <laughs> 16 is a lot. All right, 16, 16 and 30 is a lot. Outside of top five leagues in 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Starts in three, two, one, go. Po uh, Porto Sporting, Benfica, uh, Boa Vista, uh, Benenenses, um, go Ajax, PSV, uh, AZ. Um, Excelsior, um, Galatasaray, Besiktas, um, Fenerbahce, Bursa Sport, um, no, Gang, uh, Arbog, One more. Um, Molde. Damn, that is 16 that was good. four that was good, seconds sorry. to go. Did it easy. I saw the strategy, went Portugal. He, 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 he jogged geographically, man. Bro, I was struggling, I can't no, lie. you weren't. No, 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 no. Yo, this is crazy glazing, though. <laughs> You know where I would have started? Championship. I would have gone Stoke, Sunderland, Blackburn, I just did. You, know you know when I thought Prem, I did not think, I just Obviously, thought different yeah, yeah. One nil yeah, yeah. to start. I would have championship. Hey, you're the kid, I'm, I'm, my mind is blown. He's the man. All right, <laughs> the next category. Yo, chat, what is this? This is crazy glazing, bro. <laughs> I shout out to Spud for subscribing, bro. Big up you, bro. How you doing, man? Subscribe for two months, bro. <laughs> Cause he's the man. I yo, I actually love Rory, bro. I yo, I think he's so funny, bro. I think Rory is so fucking funny, man. <laughs> I have to listen to that again. You know when I thought Prem, I did not think. Champ I just thought different yeah, yeah. One nil to start there. Hey, you're the kid. I'm, I'm, my mind is blown. <laughs> he's the man. All right, the next category. I want to give you the opening bid start. How oh many God. in thirty seconds? So the, the maximum is twenty. You can't go above twenty. How many Premier League stadiums can you name? Last season, 23, 24. 12. 13. I I'll go fourteen. Do it. Fourteen. 14 yeah. Fourteen out of twenty. Fourteen in thirty seconds Oof. starts in three. Two, one, go. Kenilworth Road, Bramall Lane, Turf Moor, Etihad, Old Trafford, You see, this is why Emirates, Stars is dangerous, bro. He's White played Lane, this game three, Hospital four Stadium, times now already. London bro. Stadium. He knows the tactics. Uh, G Tech Stadium, G Tech uh, Stadium, it, yeah. Vi Vitality, um, St. James's Park. Yeah, two more. Um, St. James's Park. I've already got. Tur oh, not Turf. Uh, what's the Toffee? Two more. Got eight toffees, Toffees. Um, oh. Go to the Park. Ooh. And um, Villa Park. Oh, one second remaining. Why is Rory celebrating, bro? One second yeah, the, yeah. <laughs> Does Rory know he's competing with him, bro? <laughs> Why is Rory clapping, bro? <laughs> I don't think Rory got the rules, bro. I can't lie. I don't think Rory understood the, the concept of the game. Start taking it on you got to start taking it, trust me. The score they, is now he thinks they're on the same team or player, something. But there's plenty of time to come back in this. Okay, so start with you, Rory. How many Euros finalists can you name? 10, 12. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to step this up, aren't I? Cause I'd say go, but I'm gonna have to now 12. say 13. I would say lies, 12, li bro, 12 Euro winners. How many really are there? I'll let, I'll let you have it. You got I don't, bro, I think, nah, I think you, I would have called stars out there. Germany, England, Spain, Italy, France, Portugal. Did I say Netherlands? Czech Republic, USSR, Denmark. I'm struggling after that. Greece. 12 is a lot, bro. I don't know if Stars would have been able to do 12. I can't lie. We're in 13 and 30 seconds. In three, two, one, go. So Spain and England, uh, the USSR and the okay. Dutch, uh, France, Portugal, okay, six. Spain, yeah. Spain uh, Italy. Yeah, seven. Denmark, won it. Yeah. 92. Uh, that's decent. Five more, that's a lot, bro. Germany. All right, he's not too slow. Man. Man, this is a tough one, bro. I think, he's, I think he set himself up a little there. 
time. Yeah, it was ambitious, nine. bro. There was only 14 lot, answers. Man. There was not many. 13, 13 out of 14. Yeah. So it was good, good all over. Dumb. Probably should have told you it was only 14. I mean, you named all the top. Only 14. Nah, he Check. stitched Rory up there, bro. Come on. 13 out of 14. Myth. Absolute myth. Republic, yeah, Republic in England, that was. Yeah. That was Poborski's team in England. Uh, Belgium got to the final. <laughs> but the score is now 3 0 to star player. All right. All right, what happens if you get one. any wrong? Can first you have to symbols of country? Theoretically, you can. How many players can you name? It could be from their first name or last name. But the name has to start with an E in 30 seconds. It's hard. I'm going to go 10. E. You can name 10 E's as a first name and last name. First name or last Do you reckon? Name? I mean, I kind of feel like I have to call you. A a liar here, but I'm not going to win if I do that. Go for it. Ten in thirty seconds. I don't think so. Ten, Ten with E. Uh, I think Come on, got bro. Nah, nah. I don't think. I don't think Rory was was thinking this one through, bro. Ten E's. I think he was shook of the last one, and he's like, mm, "Could I really do ten, bro? Ten E's, first and last name." Three second buff appearing every time we answer one. Okay. In three, two, one, go. Edu Gaspar, Emil Smith Rowe, um, Eduardo Camavinga, mm. Eduardo the striker, mm. Emil Heskey. Um, Ed Milson, mm. Esteval, mm. um, Elanga, mm. um, only two more. Emerson, uh, Emerson Royale. <laughs> Honestly, like I said, bro, it's. I'm seeing a lot of the comments as well, too, in these YouTube videos of people saying, like, mm, I don't know if you should have had so many newbies against people who've played this game. And A, I, I hear why Sharky did it because it's tough. Like, Bro, there's three people. Like, they have to play a newbie. Unless, what, you put me in starts first round. But at the same time, I kind of hear it, right? Because there's tactics to win these kinds of games. For e for names, for example, you don't want to just name random names. And I think Sean did that, and it was a huge L on his part. You want to, like, kind of do it tactically. So for E, right off the bat, I would name every Eric I can think of. Eric Bailly. Eric Cantona. Eric Dyer. Eric Chupamoting. Eric Sin. Um, and then next one. I don't know. Endrick, Esteval, Brazilians, Edu, Eduardo. Like, that's the way you got to think about it. You can't just, like, kind of be all over the place. But I wouldn't blame anyone for playing like that because if you've never played it, you wouldn't know. But that's the disadvantage here. Stars has played this game three times now. Like, this is his third time playing uh, Mastermind. Rory has never played, bro. It's tough. <laughs> Enzo Fernandez or Eric Edmund. That's unbelievable. No, I know. Yeah. Yeah. But Star, I'm second, telling you, Stars is a dark horse, bro. You like name players with, beginning with E? I was like, there aren't any. Good. Yeah, <laughs> we are all over. I'm going to react to the semifinal what, no, Cambers phase of live. It's I have the final question I need of this to round. So get a point back. I don't want to spoil it either. I do hate lies, man. It's yeah. been tough questions. Yeah. But yeah. Mate, what do you mean? How can you love it? You're smashing it up. How many players, past or present, can you name to have played for Dortmund. 10? I'm gonna go 16. 16 in 30 seconds? Uh, but you're, that's defying science. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I'm telling you, man. I know he's controversial. Like, I know a lot of people don't like Rory. Personally, I love his content, honestly. Like, I don't agree with a lot of what he says in terms of his football takes. Like, I share very different takes. But bro, in terms of his actual content, in terms of the way he speaks, I think he's elite. What? Past or present, can you name to have played for Dortmund? 10? I'm gonna go 16. 16 in 30 seconds? Yeah. That's, but you're, that's defying science. <laughs> but that's defying science. He's so proper, bro. I fucking love him, bro. Honestly, the shit that he says is so funny, bro. It's so funny. Hey, be who you are. I'm, facts, bro. Facts, honestly. Again, his, his takes aren't really for me. But his actual content, like the, the, the way he speaks and the way he like, I don't know. Yeah, the way he kind of provides his content, I think it's so entertaining, bro. I think it's so, so entertaining. <laughs> what? science. You've got, two, you've got less than two seconds. Go for it. I went 10, you went 16. I'm like, that's just rude, isn't it? This <laughs> is rude, isn't it? That's rude. Didn't even play the game with me. Didn't even play the game. Like, make it, yeah. In three, two, one, go. Vadafella, Piszczek, uh, Subatic, Hummels, Schmelzer, Kel, Bender, um, Dahoud, Mark um, Roy, Goetze, Lewandowski, Aubameyang, mm. Usman Dembele. There you go, that's 13, and he's got, yeah. he's still got 18 he's seconds. He's three more. Oh, 16. Oh, 16. Ah. Three more. He's got um, what do you call it? He Julian, 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 Julian Brandt, uh, Wolf, um, Grass is just signed, but if that don't count, I'll go um, Fulkberg. Yeah, nah, Stars is dangerous now. this year, bro. Honestly, let me not lie. Stars is, you got me a little shook right now, bro. I'll be real. Of course, I back myself as anyone, but Stars right now, it started on smoke right now, man. I can't lie. That's um, fair Emery enough. Chan. Fair yeah, enough. All right, mate. No one likes to show off. No Jude Bellingham, <laughs> love. No Jude, no Holland. Yeah. I was thinking Champions League 
the final. Yeah, That's yeah, what I was basing it on. Well, that is the end of the first round after Liza's score is currently 5 nil but there's plenty of time because the next round is the buzzer round all right so now this is the buzzer round rory this is good for you because you can really attend who am i more scared really of stars or cam not just bring it back cam is the unexpected i've beat stars be already so it's going to cam, special. Cam is a, let's see if you have one you're still eyes. waiting for your first point of the game but what's good josh now nah, i want you to both have i've hands been good brother how about you so it's fair game how it's gonna work yeah, stars is really panic that's true 10 questions you get point for every question you get right. If you buzz before I finish the question, I'll stop speaking, you have to answer it. Once you buzz, I'm gonna give you five seconds max to answer the question. If you get it wrong, it goes to the other person. If he gets it wrong, I'll give you one turn each. You boys, you ready? Mm. In three, two, one. What Premier League club did Louis Van Gaal manage in 2014? Uh, Man United. <laughs> Correct. I, I beg you guys watch how, 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 star, how Rory is uh, hitting the buzzer though. What was the name of the old stadium of Tottenham Hotspur? Why is he going two hands? <laughs> Uh, I'm not hating. I'm not hating. I'm not hating. Let's go. What, why are like? Yeah. What nation won the Euros in '92? Appreciate you, Josh. Appreciate you. Denmark. Correct. What team did Ronaldo move to United? Uh, for? Sporting. Correct. What countries won the most Euros? Spain. Correct. It's a tie. Yeah. France. Spain and France. Are you sure? No. Because <laughs> <No. laughs> it's Spain. It says Spain right here. Who assisted Mario Götze in the 2014 World Cup final? Shirla. I remember the goal. Just press it. I right, someone buzz. Think about it. <laughs> Just the longest nose press buzzer. Who assisted Mario Gutz in the 2014 the World Cup final? Yo, I've never seen there this. Andre Scherler. Correct. Hey, good knowledge. What country good hosted knowledge. the World Cup in 1994? USA. Correct. Uh, what was the final yeah, score nice. of the Champions League final in 2017? 4-1. Mm, Star is a little slow on this round, Chad. I can't lie. Like, mm, I'm seeing cracks in his armor. I'm seeing cracks in his armor here. I would have got that. Who won the like Bundesliga 2011-12? Dortmund. Correct. What's the name of the current president of UEFA? Yeah, 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 yeah. I know he's bald. Uh, the bald dude. I know he's bald. <laughs> oh my god, this is hilarious. Uh, not Seferin. It's not Seferin. It's not. I told you that. It's not him. It's not him. Seferino. What's the answer? If you don't know his name, just give me the, the other person's name you thought of. Seferin. Because <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I told you it weren't him when it was. That was just malicious of me. Yeah. <laughs> Like he buzzed. It's not Seferino. I'll give you the book because he said Seferino. That's yeah. insane. That's ridiculous. Yeah, yeah. I thought Seferino. I'll be real. Yeah. Right. Seferino. You did pretty well that round. Especially the, you know, the, the, way you did, the way you did really well on the old ones. Like the yeah. 94 World Cup. 94, 94 World Cup. 92 yeah. Euro. Yeah. So it's 5-5 five, five after that round. But the score now is 10-5. Do you know what I was saying before? Just respectable. A respectable defeat. <laughs> so far. Respectable. It's like if a championship club, if QPR go to Main Road, or QPR go to the Etihad and they lose 2-0. Yeah. Jose Mourinho, chins up and that. That's it what ain't I... been called Main Road for like, like 16 years, bro. <laughs> To be here. I love how you call it Main Road. That's how classic you are. Yeah. Main Road, bro. It ain't been Main Road yeah. for so All right, long. That is the end of the second round. It is time for the third round. What do you know? Oh, this is the what do you know round. This is the one that could bring Rory back into this game. He is down 10 5, 5 right decent. Now, five to go to split it in that round of stars. That's good for Rory. Final round of stars. Increase that gap or Rory close it. Boys, you ready? We're going to start with you because you're in the lead. But as soon as I ask question, as soon as he answers, straight, straight over. over. You get five. Mm. I want to do a five second five timer seconds. to think. All right. The first one is can you name me players in Brazil squad at the 2006 World Cup? Um, R9. Rivaldo? No, lost the life, he's not a squad. That's not a good start, is it? <laughs> um, Ronaldinho. Cafu. Go Lucio. Carlos still be there? Yep. Juan. Denilson? No. One life left, go. I'm gonna go zero Roberto. Tafarel? <laughs> oh, <laughs> nah, he's thinking of the 02 World Cup with Rivaldo and Tafarel. I think Denilson was at that World Cup too. If not, he was 98. Wrong, wrong World Cup, bro. Wrong World Cup. His knowledge is too far <laughs> back, bro. O2 point, is too bro, recent for, for, for Rory, bro. Is not 11, 5. O2 is too recent for question. Rory. Pretty simple. Players to have won the Ballon d'Or. Lionel Messi. Ronaldo. Kaká. Modric. Michael Owen. Avon Neved. Kevin Keegan. Luis Figo. Karl Heinz Rummenigge. Uh, Zidane. Michael Owen. Been said. You lose a life. Michael. The life lost. Kenny Daglish? He didn't. He came ah, second, second once. Yeah. You got one life remaining. Back to you. Marco Van Basten. Oh, yes, he's one too. Rude Hullet. Rude Hullet. Uh, Karen yeah. Benzema. Rude Hullet? Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna nice. pass. Yeah, he uses pass. Pass. Smart. Uh, There's so many left. Come on. Uh, 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 Platini, sorry, Platini, Platini. Fingers gone down when you said it. Because it's my turn now, right? Platini. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> no, Platini. No, I can't do that. I can't do that. <laughs> no, no, you're on that. Flip, take it. <laughs> Back to you. Maradona. 
Point, no, the point is yours. You won the point. Mateus hey, and Platini. Oh, no, 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 no from Mateus and Platini. Platini. Who am I thinking of? The obvious answer. Old school, like 1990. Eusebio. That's what kept... <laughs> oh, man. I love this guy, bro. Honestly. <laughs> He's actually amazing. He's actually amazing, bro. You know he makes HP. HP looks 50 years younger because of Rory, bro. He's like, who's the obvious answer? The one that everyone comes to mind. Like, you save you. You, you save you for 1966 World Cup. That's the obvious one. You save you. <laughs> this guy's incredible. I kept trying to think of that. You're very unlucky, Platini. It's a great answer. Very unlucky. So this one, there's only 16 possible answers. So if you go back and forth and complete all 16, the person with more lives remaining will get the point. I can accept that. That would be an honor. Let's get, let's get, you get the point, but let's get 16. As a, <laughs> we're a team. One bro, this guy lost the plot. Bro, this guy said we're a team. 2,000 pounds on the line. He said we're a team. Let's do it together. Yo, this is about like one of those, um, it's, it's not about the competition. It's about the friends you made along the way type video, bro. What the team hell's going on here, man? One team, one dream. Mate, we're like York and Cole. And actually, it's a perfect candidate for both of you. Start with you stars. Players that have played for both like York Chelsea and, and Arsenal. Oh, William you. Gallas. Ashley Cole. Gallas. Olivier Giroud. David Rowcastle. Jorginho. Kai Havertz. William. David Luiz. Omar Hutchinson. Omar Hutchinson counts, yeah? yeah. Counts. One life lost. Patrick. Says Fabregas. There we go. Mm. Now you guys are opening up. <laughs> Anoka. There we mm. go, boys. Lost another life. Oh. Emmanuel Petit. There Ooh. we go. Great answer. Think, think, think. Stars in his bag right now. How many do we have left? Yeah, like two or three think, left. Think. So, Jimmy Neutron Yossi type Yossi Ben B, Oh, and Asana Diara. So we missed those three. Okay. So 13. But Stars, you do get a point. Yeah. You lost all your lives. You get a point for that right now. Just still two more of what do you know to go. 12, 6. You get the last two, seven and eight. Rory's not bad at this game. That's the thing, bro. Yeah, like, but I feel like different. he went this into one, this with too uh, much of a defeatist attitude. You did say, obviously, we spoke at Dortmund earlier. He said German teams aren't your forte. Oh, no. How have I got two German current mm. players that currently oh. play in, for Bayern Munich? That's some Brighton no, versus Palace type mate, rivalry. Mate, this is bro. a disaster. Current squad. What are you doing? Mate, Bayern. someone needs to talk to the to the to the question master. Two German questions. Starting with you, current. Bayern I, that's players. how you Start know with... how proper and posh Rory is, bro. Mensa, I'm not answering any questions about Germans. England, England, fuck the Germans. <laughs> I basically know Harry Kane. All right. Oh back my. His <laughs> one answer for a German team is as the Englishman. I'm fucking dead, bro. I'm dead, bro. <laughs> Mate, that's just that's just showing off, isn't it? I don't. I'm gonna have to. I think I'm gonna have to just concede this. I don't know. You could have went for the You don't know keeper. a single leave... player bar Harry Kane. Come on, yeah, Rory. Yeah, but, uh, Joshua right. Kimmich. Okay, I should actually think. Because you're right, I would have got Kimmich. Uh, I will... One life left. Two world wars, one world, 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 world cup. Defender. <laughs> Eric Dyer. There we go, Alfonso Davis. See, we're a team. <laughs> See, you're a team. <laughs> Manuel <laughs> Neuer. I'll go, I'll go Pavlovich. Former Arsenal guy. That played I'll, right I'll, wing. I'll go Jim What's going on here, chap? What's going on here? Star's giving him the answers. Bro. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm about to say it right now. Last year on Mastermind, the, ra the, the first rounds were really good. Me versus Stars was, was, was tight. Uh, Ilyas versus Fuad, that was an upset. Liban versus Abs was competitive. Fu versus, versus Faisal, not so much. But then the semifinals, they were blowouts. I killed Abs uh, and, and Faisal destroyed Ilyas. But this, this is so bad, honestly, chat. Me versus Pingu was a whitewash. Rory vs. Stars has been worse than a whitewash. This is like two friends basically just giving each other answers. HP vs. Cams was like, bro, back to the retirement home you go. And then Sean, oh my god, the way he disgraced himself. This has been an awful first round for Mastermind. Awful. Like, bro, I'm going to assume Stars won this, right? So me and Stars and Faisal vs. Cam, the entire fate of this season is on our shoulders. Like, we have to produce classics. Stars has to give me a good game, and Cam versus Faisal has to be as good. Bro, this is bad, man. This is so bad. There's no competitiveness this, this season, bro. What is this? Nah, the semifinals have to be crazy, bro. Oh, you can. Yeah, I'll go Leroy Sun. You go they gotta the be crazy. Guy. German. Play for us. Went West Brom for a bit. Oh, yeah, he's brilliant. Uh, Nabry. I'll go, I'll go Matisse Tell. <laughs> Where's the Lick playing at the moment today? The Lick's playing for Bayern. Uh, get confirmed. Uh, I'm time recording, recording, by the way. I'll go. I'll go Goretzka. And now, because it's minorly respectable, I'm going to fall on my sword, and you get the point for all of your help, and I appreciate that. 
I can't believe what I'm watching right now, Chad. I'm so confused. I can't believe what I'm watching right now. I'm so confused. That round. Mate, we're a team. Final question of this. What do you know around before we get into the final round of the whole we're video? Is players that started. So 22 nah, names. Bro, players that started in the 2022 Champions League final between Liverpool and Real Madrid. I'll go Allison. I'll go Trent Alexander Arnold. I'll go Ibrahim Konate. I'll go Virgil van Dijk. I'll go Robertson. Stop doing that. Go to the Stop. other team, you. You, you, you're good. Go to the other team. I'll go Mohamed Salah. You go Mohamed Salah. I'll go Sadi Mane. Stop it. Go to the other team. <laughs> uh, I will go for Benzema. Jordan Henderson, because he didn't say it. Um, I will go. Uh, he played in midfield. Junior Wijnaldum? No. Nope. Go so, Vinicius. Thibaut Courtois. Yeah. yeah. I'll go um, Carvajal. Luka Modric. I'll go Tony Cruz. I'll go Casemiro. Edin Militar. Mm. I'll go. That's it, so you deserve a point. One life left. Uh, David Alaba. For me, no play through the middle. So that's all your life's done. Oh, Fabinho man. played in the middle. Yeah. Thiago Alcantara also it's played. Luis Diaz also thing. played. All right, so the end of this round, the scores are 14-6. Yo, my competition There's is one round best, left, and that is right now, bro. Time's up. Right, Stars got underrated ball. I'm telling on. you, Stars are a threat. Stars is a threat right now. Are you ready? In three, two, one. What club does City sign De Bruyne from? Genk. Wolfsburg. Uh, who was top scorer in the Premier League in 2017-2018? Salah. Yep. What country uh, won the World Cup in 2006? Italy. Italy. Who was the Ballon d'Or uh, winner in 98? 98 would have been... Oh, I think, think, hang on, 98. Shevchenko? No, it's Zidane. What year was Lamar born? You mean Lamar? Oh, uh, 16 years ago. <laughs> <laughs> what year, what year? Uh, it's not 2000 and... It's not worth this time that you no, wasted. I... Seven. What club won the most of the Liga titles? Real Madrid. Yep. Who scored a winning penalty in Champions League final in 2012 for Chelsea? Uh, Didier Jopa. Yep. Who holds the record for the most goals scored in a single Premier League season? Haaland. Uh, Erling Haaland. Yep. Who was the manager of uh, Arsenal before Unai Emery? Before Unai Emery. I'm telling you, Emery. right? Yep. I told Cam this exact same thing last time. And Loki, I'm giving Cam solid information. Like, if I end up playing Cam, I can't lie. If I end up losing, it's because I gave him this many tips. But, um... Bro, the difference between great mastermind players and, I guess, regular mastermind players is the great mastermind players like me, Faisal, Cam, Stars, clearly, you basically di dissect the, the, the question as you're hearing it. You listen and hear at the same time. It's just like in, in, in school, right? Like if you're asked questions, what, what's it called? Like interactive listening or whatever the fuck it's called. Um, there's, there's an actual phrase for it. Um, maybe you guys can help me think of it. Like... You can't hear it and then dissect the information. You have to, to hear and listen at the same time. Therefore, when Sharky asks you a question, it can't be like, what year was Yamal born? You ask yourself, what year was Yamal born? The minute he's asking it, you have to just like compute it. That, that's, that's the only way you can win these kinds of games because you have to be quick. Uh, who won the Serie A in 2020-2021? Active listening. Thank you. Perfect. Inter Milan. Yep. Uh, who was top scorer in Champions League in 1920? 1920? No, 2019, 2020. Is it like these oh. ass... Okay, no, uh, Yeah. 2020. You probably uh, could 19, name it. 2019, 2020 would have been... Tell you. Sir Stanley Matthews. Oh, Cristiano Ronaldo. No, it was Robert Lewandowski. Okay. The problem is, you spent too long on no, two well, questions way too and long, the other, you got them wrong anyway. So your final yeah, score, you still lose. Oh, Let's oh, see how stars does. We're not going to let him know. We're going to yeah. let him assume he did well. Welcome back. <laughs> uh, uh, wait, the 20 out of 20, I was up 8, so I have to hit 12. I right, cool, fair enough. 13. Yeah. It is tough. All right, stars, are you ready? You have one minute to answer these questions. In three, two, one. What club did Man City sign uh, the boy from? Uh, Wolfsburg. Who was top goal scorer in the Premier League 2017 2018 season? Um, Kane. Salah. What you see how quickly he's answering the question? I know he was wrong there, but like he's listening and thinking at the same time. The others, they're, they're hearing it and then trying to, to, to think. You can't do that. Don't you want to walk up to Sun 6? Um, who won the Oh my god. Walk up to Sun 6? Italy. Who won the Ballon d'Or in 98? Um, Zidane. What year was Lamini Mar born? 06. 07. What club has the most Liga titles? Yeah. Uh, Real Madrid. Who scored the winning penny in the Champions League final in 2012? Um, pass. Jobba. What player holds the record for most goals scored in the Premier League final? Uh, Erlen Haaland. Who was the manager for Arsenal before Emery? Oh, Wenger. What team won the Serie A in 2020-2021? Uh, um, Juventus. Inter Milan. Who was top scorer in Champions League in 1920? Champions League? Yep. Uh, what'd you say? Who was top scorer in Champions League in 2019 Ronaldo. Lewandowski. What country hosted the Euros in 2004? Greece. Portugal. Who won the FIFA Women's World Cup in 2015? 
I don't know, Paul. United States. What club did Ibrahimovic join after leaving PSG in 2016? United. Correct. Who was the captain of the French? I was, I've started, so I'll finish. Who was the captain of the French national team during the 2018 World Cup win? Lloris. Uh, Lloris. Hugo Lloris, the correct answer. What was his final score in that round? Eight was his overall final score. 22 is your final score. Is that enough for you to have won the game and the episode? The answer is yes! <laughs> The final score is 22-13. 22-13. So this is the final scores of all the first rounds, guys, right? Me versus Pingu. 31-13. Stars versus Rory. 22-13. I'm surprised Rory got 13, to be fair. That's more than I thought he was going to get. HP versus Cam. I can't remember, but you wiped the floor of him. And then stars or a foo or sorry, Faisal versus Sean blowout. Look, 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 look. So the, the, the semifinals are decided. Kem is playing Faisal tomorrow. And be on my Twitch at exactly the time it drops. Hasib, do not be late. I'm reacting to it the second it drops. I need I need to see how that went down. And then obviously. I'm playing stars. There's a lot of pressure on all of us, right? Not even to just win, but bro, we need to save the season. Th this first round has been awful. I can't believe how bad it is. And low key, I'm not even gonna take a jab at the people who competed because yo, first of all, it's not easy coming on a channel as big as SDS or just kind of stepping out of your, your comfort zone and doing something like this. But also I'm looking at Sharky. These matchups were mismatches, bro. These, these matchups were mismatches. There, there needs to be entertainment and competitiveness, like together in these next two rounds, bro. And here's a message to star player. Me, I'm not interested in making competitive. I want to win by as many points as possible. Stars has been telling everybody last year he feels robbed. He feels like there were some questions that I got that I shouldn't have got my way. You have a second chance at fate, my friend. You have a second chance. Don't let it slip. Don't let it slip, brother, because I'm on smoke this year, bro. I got 31. I don't think anybody has got 31 points out of all the other contestants right now. I probably have the highest score. Don't let me get 31 on your ass too, bro. Don't let me get 31 on your ass too, stars. And then Faisal and Cam, brother, yo, if I could pay, I would pay anything to go see that. Anything. I want to be there so f bad, man. But anyways, SDS Mastermind, first round is done. Semifinals. We here. We live. And I'll say it again. We come.